if we're in E harmonic minor and you got the two chord, F sharp minor seven flat five to B seven flat nine, two, five, one. So each chord off each scale tone, E minor major seven, F sharp minor seven flat five, G major seven sharp five, A minor seven, B dominant seven, C major seven, E flat diminished. All these are within E harmonic minor. When any of these chords are played, if they're connecting to one or the other and you're in a key, you're not supposed to necessarily outline the chords. You're supposed to play the scale that the chords are from or play the sound that it's from. But what does it mean to know a scale? It's not playing it up and down. It's playing it in thirds, playing it in fourths, playing it in fifths, playing it in sixths, mixing it up, playing it in thirds, then fourths. But if you really wanna know and tell the truth, you have to play the sounds that the chords are implying. F sharp minor seven flat five to B seven flat nine, those two chords, if you're in a key, implies E harmonic minor. If you simply play right up the scale, you'll sound correct. But it's really about how you connect on playing shades. Everybody's worried about arpeggiating in a chord. But if you really play a scale correctly and you know how to get around it, all that stuff should be built in.